Hi, Chiro Hermanos. How is it going? This Sunday, April the 14th, is International Goalkeepers Day. And therefore, I would like to reflect on the current situation of the Chivas and the Chivas Femenil Goals. Kicking off with Chivas, we gotta say that the red and white goal has gone through a tumultuous time over the last few years, where different candidates to sustain the Chivas goal have gone through, and there have been some with more success than others. However, there has been constant change, but finally, it seems that the Chivas goal is pretty safeguarded for the years to come and that we have found a stable couple with El Tala Rangel and Oscar Wally. Born and raised in the municipality of Zapotlán El Grande in Ciudad Guzmán, located in the state of Jalisco, Raúl Rangel is a tapatío de nacimiento who joined the Chivas Youth Academy once he arrived to the Cantera Rojiblanca discipline, El Tala disputed 36 matches with the Chivas under 20 squad and then continued making a name for himself with El Tapatio, where he disputed 63 matches. The 24 year old has already signed memorable performances in his first 20 matches with the Chivas first team. Furthermore, El Tala joins an extended tradition of Tapatio goalkeepers defending the Chivas goal. Other memorable Chivas goalkeepers born in the state of Jalisco include Gilberto El Coco Rodriguez, Ignacio El Cuate Calderón, Javier El Zuli Ledesma, Oswaldo Sánchez, or Luis Michel. Far from being a tapatío de nacimiento, but as Mexican as the rest, we have Oscar Wally, who represents a complementary background. At the age of 30, Wally can already brag about being a trotamundos del fútbol, as he counts with experience in Spanish football, as well as in the Greek and Danish leagues. His 129 matches in the Spanish second division speak for themselves. His exposure to different playing styles, different systems, and to a wide range of footballing cultures make Oscar Wally a valuable element. And what can we say about one of the Chiva Nation's favorite duo? What can we say about our dear Blanca Felix and Celeste Espino, which are two goalkeepers who probably we don't realize it right now, but will go through for years to come as the pioneers of the two great Chivas goalkeepers that started this glorious path that girls, other girls will fulfill. What to say about our dear Blanca and Celeste? We are witnessing a pair who will be remembered and spoken about amongst the upcoming generations as pioneers of Liga MX Femenil. Blanca Felix and Celeste Espino share the fact that they have already practiced football at a high level before the birth of the Liga MX Femenil. Blanca did it at the Universidad Autónoma de Sinaloa, while Celeste at the Mexican Football Federation Centers of High Performance in order to be eligible for the youth national teams. Blanca is from Sinaloa, Celeste is from Guadalajara, and they both share the fact that Chivas has been their one and only jersey throughout their professional careers. Their paths have always been intertwined. Celeste joined El Rebaños Youth Forces at the age of 14 in October of 2017, same semester that Blanca helped the team in winning the first ever Liga MX Femenil title. Since Celeste made her first team debut in September of 2020, Blanca and Celeste have had each other's back. Blanca and Celeste, Celeste and Blanca, for many more saves, moments and titles, 
for many more memories and stories together for many more years to come. On behalf of the Chivas English and on the Chivas Digital team, I would like to wish every single goalkeeper across red and white disciplines a happy goalkeeper's day, especially of course to Tala Rangel, Oscar Wally Celeste Espino and Blanca Felix. We love you guys and we value your work and your constant effort for this shield. I hope that you guys have a happy Sunday. Signing off this edition of We Go News, I am Alfredo Rodriguez and as always, Arriba las Chivas.